Yep. I bought a fly combo. Oh no, no, no. <laughs> I bought. I bought a fly combo. Now, I have no training, no lessons fly fishing. So, it's gonna be a show. I have fly fished for a total of probably an hour in my life. Half an hour being for pike and another half an hour being for trout. And I have yet to catch a fish on a fly setup. So, like I said, I picked this puppy up and I want to fly fish. So that's what we're gonna do. I should probably watch a couple YouTube videos because my form will be awful but i don't have time for that tonight we're about an hour until sunset so i'm gonna tie on some sort of popper fly thing and we're gonna try to catch some bass or some rock bass or some sunfish or something but like i said i'm a total noob i don't i know what a stone fly is i know what a what a, one of those like steelhead flies is because i caught my first steelhead on it and that's about it so <laughs> it's gonna be interesting for all you fly fishermen to watch but I'm pretty excited. This is something I've been wanting to try for a very, very long time. I have never really had the time to. And so finally, I just, I was just like, screw it. We're gonna get a fly set up and we're gonna go and we're gonna fly fish. This is my first time fly fishing from a boat as well. So hopefully I don't hook and break anything, but I'm gonna go get my fly box and we're gonna tie a little popper on and go have some fun. Hopefully catch some fish, that'd be, that'd be pretty cool. There's a lot of like little fish busting and minnows busting right now in this little bay, so. My hopes are pretty high. <laughs> so this is what we have for our selection. That's a woolly bugger. I know what that is. <laughs> That's a, a Johnston steel something. I don't know. And then we have a bunch of poppers. I'm going to tie a popper on. We're going to go with the, let's go with the black one. We're going to go with the black popper. Uh, it's not really black. Oh well, we'll go with the black one. And we're going to see if we can catch some fish. I'm pretty excited, like I said. I have, I know nothing about fly fishing at all, so it's going to be kind of a show, but... I mean... <laughs> as long as I remember to set the hook on tight line, we should be okay. <laughs> we should be okay. We'll see. My hopes are pretty high for this evening, I can't lie. Hopefully, uh... I'm not disappointed, but... Wow, this islet is... Tiny. I think it's fun. I think it's going to be challenging, which is something I'm interested in right now because fishing is kind of the same old, same old fish move. I catch them kind of deal. This is like, I have to actually learn how to cast. <laughs> I am going to tell you now, my form is pretty, pretty sh So you guys have that to look forward to. Okay, <laughs> that looks pretty good. I'm pretty excited. Oh, something just jumped over there. Okay, I'm gonna get all my camera gear set up and we'll, we'll get to casting. I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing. There's a drag on this thing. I just... <laughs> no! Ugh. That sucks so much. <laughs> That was a bass too, that wasn't even a rock bass. I'm going after rock bass right now because I know they're, you know, easy to get. That was a full-fledged bass. <laughs> oh man, that sucks. No, I'm just trying to learn how to use a fly rod. It's hard. <laughs> oh, you're kidding. 
as I was moving, I got one. I'll just cast around here, maybe. How do I roll cast? That. I want to get over there. Close enough. It's a stump. Should be a rock bass off the stump. No! <laughs> no! What did I say? I told you there's a rock bass off that stump. <sighs> yes. I think the camera was rolling for that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yes. I've never been so happy to catch a rock bass in my life. <sighs> He ate that popper. Yes. <laughs> Where's that hook? Okay. <laughs> oh. Thank you, Rock Bass. Thank you. Yes. <laughs> oh. Just as the sun goes down. Yes! All right, the sun has set. I'm gonna continue this tomorrow. And we're back at it with the fly set up. Uh, I'm gonna try to fish an hour or so, the wind's about to pick up, so pretty much until the wind pick, pick, picks up, I'll be fishing. And uh, yeah, the goal is to land some fish on the fly setup. I know I'll get a lot of bites, I just need to land them, which is the biggest issue. The, the hook, as you guys can see, is actually on the bottom of the lure, which is... Is it on the bottom, or does it pop like this? I don't know, I'm hooking them on the bottom of the mouth, so I'm guessing it's on the bottom of the lure. And so it's kind of hard to set the hook into them, but... We're gonna make things work, and uh, yeah, I'm pretty excited. Lost him. The hook on this bait is on the bottom. So it's kind of it's kind of hard to actually set the hook. Maybe she have to take it more. There you go. There you go. Yes. <laughs> yes. Come here. Come here. Boat flip. <laughs> yes. That's right. There you are, guys. On the fly setup. Tiny, tiny, itty bitty. Rock bass. Let's get him back. <laughs> uh, and that being said, I don't lose my prop in these rocks. So let's get on out of here. The wind's just starting to pick up. I'm gonna keep on fishing until the wind gets too strong for an itty bitty popper like this, but <sighs> it's so fun. It's so fun, I love it. My casting is definitely also getting a lot better, like a lot better, <laughs> which is good. I just want the wind to stay down so I can still fish it effectively. I have a feeling this is going to be like steelheading for me at the beginning. I'll go like 20 and one, <laughs> as in 20 hookups and one fish landed. <laughs> Come on. How do I roll cast? Let's figure that out one day. <sighs> Good enough. There you go. Come on. No, I missed him. Come on. No. I saw him come up for it. I saw him come up for it and eat it. 
<laughs> Alright guys, so that is a wrap on my first couple fish on a fly setup. Looking back at it, I suck at setting the hook, or I suck at landing fish. I have to give them more time with it, I think. But we have a lot of blow-ups, just not a lot of lands. Still sucks that I lost that first bass. That was the only bass that I hooked onto the, the past two days. Um, but yeah, I don't really know what I'm doing, so I don't feel that bad. <laughs> but yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this little video. I will probably f be fly fishing a fair bit. Um, the main reason why I got this is actually for brook trout. So we'll see how much I'll be fishing for brook trout with a fly rod. But in the meantime, I will be fishing for bass and rock bass and other easier fish to catch just so I can gain some momentum on the fly rod and of course improve my form and my casting because it's still probably very garbage. But I don't know, hopefully you guys enjoy the video. And I am at school right now, so if you guys want to keep up to date with what I'm doing, go follow Lady Bass Fishing on Instagram, and I'll keep you guys up to date on Instagram, of course. I'll be posting less because I'll be fishing less, obviously, but I mean, other than that, if you guys like this fly fishing stuff, let me know down below. A little bit of a change of pace, and other than that, I'll see you guys in the next one.